So we hear all the time about the struggles for power with the United States and China and India and the geopolitical landscape that is shifting under our feet. Uh, but let's make no mistake, there are a handful of technology companies that are increasingly having a larger and larger geopolitical influence abroad and here in the United States. Amazon, Apple, Facebook, Google, and Twitter are no longer merely large companies. They have taken control of aspects of our society, of the economy, that were a long exclusive preserve of the state. The same goes for Chinese companies, Alibaba, ByteDance, and Tencent. According to Ian Bremmer of the Eurasia Group, we are reaching what he calls a techno-polar moment, that we need to account for these technology players on a world platform, their influence, over politics, over the socioeconomic and the psychological aspects of societies continue to increase. And they are exercising a form of sovereignty unseen in human history. In essence, they are creating this sovereign digital space unencumbered by governments, by regulation, by politics. The conversations with regards to the metaverse, this new infinite universe, with infinite potential is the modern day Wild West. Facebook accounts for nearly 3 billion monthly active users. Google reports that over a billion hours of videos are consumed on YouTube each day. In this next phase, this data sphere will see cars, factories, and entire cities wired trading data. As this realm grows, the ability to control it will slip further. The sophistication power and influence that these technological actors currently play cannot be understated. Above and beyond the macroeconomic implications, the geopolitical implications are the psychological on an individual basis. These guys are in essence behavioral modification empires. They have now dialed in and have figured out how to hack the human brain. We are sheep that are being migrated into pastures of which we don't know. We need to take back this, we need to acknowledge it, and we need to formulate a plan that is pro-human first.